super low frequency is the ITU designation for electromagnetic waves in the frequency range between 30 Hz and 300 Hz. They have corresponding wavelengths of 10,000 to 1,000 km. This frequency range includes the frequencies of AC power grids. Another conflicting designation which includes this frequency range is extremely low frequency, which in some contexts refers to all frequencies up to 300 Hz. Because of the extreme difficulty of building transmitters that can generate such long waves, frequencies in this range have been used in very few man-made communication systems. However, SLF waves can penetrate seawater to a depth of hundreds of meters. Therefore, in recent decades the U.S., Russian and Indian military have built huge radio transmitters using SLF frequencies to communicate with their submarines. The U.S. Naval Service is called Seafarer and operates at 76 Hz. It became operational in 1989 but was discontinued in 2004 due to advances in VLF communication systems. The Russian service is called ZEVS and operates at 82 Hz. The Indian Navy has an operational ELF communication facility at the INS Katabomban Naval Base to communicate with its Orient class and Akula class submarines. The requirements for receivers at SLF frequencies is less stringent than transmitters, because the signal strength is far above the noise floor of the receiver, so small, inefficient antennas can be used. Radio amateurs have received signals in this range using simple receivers built around personal computers, with coil or loop antennas connected to the PC's sound card. Signals are analyzed by a software fast Fourier transform algorithm and converted into audible sound. See also, communication with submarines. External articles, Tomislav Stimak, Definition of Frequency Bands. IK1QFK homepage. NASA Live Streaming ELF VLF Receiver References